Hello, hello, all you beautiful souls. This is Bunny Love. Um, it's great to see you guys. Glad that I can be back. Um, there's a lot of things that are going on, and I just had to ground and balance myself and kind of push through them because nothing can hold me down or get me down. Um, but these energies that are passing through and other personal things that I've had to take care of has been great. I mean, overall, it's great. This video, um, just a little FYI here, this video is going to be a little bit different for this one, but first and foremost, I want to thank all of my subscribers that have stuck with me. Um, I greatly appreciate all of you. I have so much gratitude for the fact that you guys at least watch my videos, stick by my side, and show me that you care about me enough to follow me. Um, to the new subscribers, you know, I want to tell you that I greatly appreciate you for when my messages come through and you click on them out of curiosity, just know that that message is for you at that time for you to be drawn and I greatly appreciate you so don't forget to hit the like and subscribe button and that little notification button because then you'll be able to see the upcoming videos. Um, I'm not just the natural intuitive healer and psychic with the psychic medium abilities and the Hayoki empath um, but I'm also here to give messages that most people wouldn't put out there, but I don't have the fear to put it out there. When I am divinely guided to give the message, I give the message, and that's what I'm here to do. So I greatly appreciate all of you. You don't even know or can begin to understand. So this video that... I have been channeled this morning because I was sitting out there with my doggy and we were doing our solitude, our meditation, and just chilling out there on the deck, you know, listening to the sounds of nature, beautiful Mother Earth Gaia. And all of a sudden, it's like I get this message and says, grab your paper and pen because I have a lot to say to you. And I was like, okay. So I grabbed my paper and pen and here I am to display it to you. So let's get down to business. <laughs> or the message, I should say. Um, I did write it in my journal, so if you see me looking down, it's because I want to make sure that I relay all the messages to you that was channeled to me. And at the end of this reading, we will get um, messages or confirmations from the soul's journey by James Van Prague. Uh, we will get messages from the daily healing from Ina Single. I don't know if you can see it because that, there we go. And then we will get um, the C Melodies by Jessica Lay. Okay, there we go. So we will close it off with that. Um, the first thing that Spirit wants me to bring up is a lot of you through this change, um, the energy, the full moon that we are going through, a lot of a lot of you people are lacking courage because of mental, emotional, physical, past hurts, relationship, traumatic events that have happened in your life. And this period that we're in right now is the Lionsgate portal, and the synchronicity is 888 portal, okay? So on August 8th, is the most powerful, most significant time, but you are being guided by the lion's guides to claim your throne, okay? And stand in your power and let life begin for you. This is like a rebirth. This is like a renewal, whether it's in a relationship, whether, sorry, the camera bumped, but my doggy's over here eating. Um, but this is a time for the rebirthing, the renewal, the reunions, and everything that are taking massive changes, okay? So then as they were channeling to me, this is what I was further channeled, and it says, and I'm going to read it to you. 
It says, I have the courage to change and change your life. Stand in your power and remember your life matters. Okay. All of you matter. Every one of you beautiful souls matter. Okay. So do it here and now. If you are scared, put them feelings to the front, reach out and don't hold back. You are much more beautiful when you take your power back. To love yourself first is a gift of gratitude. It gives an attitude to conquer your desires, your wishes, your dreams, because you will be unstoppable, unshakable, and unbreakable just like me. Okay? And then the message goes a little further um, into it. And they want me to explain the lion's portal, the lion's gate. Okay, and this, this portal is very significant because the Lion's Gateway is an energy. It's all about being more fully awakened to who you are, to your inner and outer self. Um, it's our divine light and it embodying the divinity uh, within the physical form. Like Star Cyrus, you know, he's like 26 times the size of the sun, but it's a serious source of spiritual light on your inner planes, okay? And it's associated with your heart center or your heart chakra, and it re represents the individuality of expression of the divine potent waves that are coming through to you. So you're you're feeling these significant energy surges coming to you with new thoughts, new creative ideas, new relationships, um, renewal within yourself, wanting to make changes. <clears throat> because the lion's portal is significant of change, change and transformation, okay? And it's supercharged with Archangel Orion. And this will help you relax to cleanse yourself to refresh your refresh yourself and clear your chakras within your soul because the light that we carry gives us a new level of love and light to ourselves with lots of infinitive love and light and lots of gratitude okay so the lion's gate energy is light codes of ascension mastery evolution um, from Cyrus it pours towards the earth called the spiritual sun okay and with that spiritual sun and with knowing that the lion's portal is considered changes and transformation a lot of you who um, love music and the way that that vibration makes you feel um, and goes within yourself to vibrate at a level where it, it's like healing to you. The lyrics are healing. Okay. So spirit is also saying, go in, do your shadow work and believe in yourself and the ones who are fighting addiction, mental, past hurts, emotional, physical, they're saying here is a great place to start. Now is the great place to start. And it's most powerful. So, <clears throat> excuse me. And I will put this information that I'm about to give you now down in the description of the video. But anybody who relates to music, Everybody who knows me knows that Godsmack is my favorite band, okay? And they have created, Sully Erna, he has created the scarsfoundation.org slash Sully Erna from Godsmack, where he is a musician and has built this foundation to help the people in need, meaning you, you are the ones in need, whoever's watching this, whoever it resonates with, you are the ones that this is pertaining to for right now. But for the ones who have done their work and need to pay it for, forward, 
go to the scarsfoundation.org and donate to help the people he's trying to reach out to. Um, because as you, most music lovers have, you know, when you follow him and see, um, he has a goal to reach 100K, okay, in a week. And this is to help all of you beautiful souls in need of whether it's mental health or addiction, go to his website and look at the description and read, you know, because it may help you. It, it may guide you to where you need to be, but, you know, just go to the site and look because he posted last night also that he is doing an auction for some of his most prized possession guitars of the albums that he has written um, and one of the drum kits that he has specifically used in the album. And they're all signed by Sully, Shannon, Tony, and Robbie, okay? And it will make you glow. It will make you glow for all music lovers. So um, I need to make sure that you know, you know, have the courage to let him help you in this beautiful foundation that he has come up with, with the beautiful heart that he has. And for all others, you know, give back as you plant your seeds, changing one life at a time. You know, there's, if it helps, if his foundation helps one person at a time, he's meeting his goal within his heart because he's not doing it for other reasons. He's doing it because he truly cares. And that's a beautiful soul. Um, you know, let the music carry your soul because God smack is phenomenal. And I told you so. I, and everybody that comes across me, everybody knows me. I always say the lyrics that he writes is straight from his heart chakra. And that's why it touches so many of you. So why don't you pay it forward to him and help him reach his goal to keep helping people like you so that he can conquer everything that he is striving to do to change one person a day or one person's life, okay? Um, being that Sully, Shannon, Tony, and Robbie are four sacred souls um, to guide you to your authentic self, to get the help you need, to be better than you were yesterday and even better than you are today to become an even greater tomorrow, okay? So all of you who struggle, please go check it out because it, it is phenomenal what he is doing. And there's so many others that are doing it, but this band I have followed for over 20 years and to see them conquer and achieve what they have and to build this beautiful foundation, that is a heart of gold. Go for it, you know, because your life matters and you're not alone. You're not alone because as everybody who follows the band, they're human too. And they've gone through addictions. They've gone through mental health issues, emotional, past hurts, everything. You're not alone. Okay. And also, I want to thank you for allowing me to give you this channeled message um, because this is your first stepping stone. And the ones who have already conquered it, congratulations to you. I am so proud of you for the courage and the strength that you have endured. Um, and I always refer to that song. Um, I think it's Ugly Kid Joe. Um, I get knocked down, but I get back up again. Yeah, that's talking about the addiction. That's talking about getting knocked down, picking yourself up, you know? So have the courage because there's many people that go through all the same stuff that you go through. And that's why I'm here to give you this message, to let you know you're not alone, but to have that beautiful part of that foundation to come out to be another help tied with the music industry. That speaks volumes right there. So now we will get some 
soul journey um, messages to confirm this message so that you guys can see that this is a channeled message. This is not just something that I'm saying or doing. Um, it was very weird how this message was coming into me about courage, mental health, emotional, physical, past hurt, abuse, whatever it may be. And, you know, this may trigger some people, but that's what it is meant to do. It is trigger you to help push you forward and stop being that car that is like stuck in a mud pit that can't get out and you're just sitting there spinning your wheels. Just know, buckle your seatbelt and have the courage to hit that gas and push forward. So God's goddess. Ascended Masters, Archangels, and Spirit Guides, what messages do you have to confirm? Thank you. My message for this channeled message that you had given me for everybody. Okay. So the messages that came out is purpose. I know what I am here to do, and I have this purpose to give you this message to help give you the courage to step forward Start going within, doing the changes that you need to do. Start being your better self for your highest good. So thank you, Spirit. Oh, and then we have courage. Okay? Ain't it funny how they channeled this message to me and then the courage card shows up here to confirm that everything that I'm saying came from Spirit. And it says, I find the inner strength to face fear with confidence. Okay, so this is a way to step back in your power, have that courage. And then, of course, spirit, I love them because I tried to put a little humor in this, even though it is a serious subject and it's very dear to my heart. I have helped many people through these challenging times. And with the humor, it says, I choose to focus on the lighter side of life. Okay, so when you go within yourself and you start making this, knowing that you're not alone and you take them for stepping stones, you're, when you get through the process, you can look back and reflect back and see that it, it's funny in a way that you can make love and light out of it, but you can also pat yourself on the back and know that you have done the hard work. So now we will get a daily healing card and I will do three shuffles, God's goddess, ascended masters, archangel, spirit guides, and kindred loved ones. What messages do you have for the daily healing to confirm the message that you have channeled for me for the collective watching this video at this time? What messages do you have for my collective, please? What messages do you have for my collective, please? To give them confirmation of the courage and, oops, thank you. Okay, it says, take responsibility for every thought and every feeling. It can affect the whole universe, okay? So any negative thoughts that are going through your mind it not only affects you, but energetically, it affects everybody that is connected to you. So the universe is saying, take responsibility, take that stepping stone and go within and do that work. Thank you, spirit. And then it says, try to avoid harmful influences. Yes. So the people in your life who are keeping you in this low energy vibration, spirit is saying that you need to See who is in your little net circle there because they might be harmful influences that are keeping you down on these lower energies and not allowing you to ascend and transform and change. Okay, so thank you, Spirit. And then we will get a C Melody card for the confirmation. And I will do three shuffles. So God's Goddess, Ascended Masters, Archangels, Spirit Guides, and Kindred Loved Ones. What other messages do you have to go with this message that was channeled for the collective that are watching? What message would you like to give the collective? 
that confirms the message for their courage and to push forward. Thank you. All right, so the first card that you got is move. Okay, and it says, barricades only grow on the decks and docked ships. Okay, so you are the only one that can put barricades up to not do this for yourself. You're the only one that can stop yourself and park your ship and dock it and get off and do that inner work, okay? So thank you, Spirit. And the other one is uh, optimism. After each uh, rainstorm, there will be clear skies. Okay? So Spirit is saying, be optimistic about this. Have a more positive attitude. Go within yourself. Because when you do all of this inner work, that happiness, that bliss, that joy that you're going to feel to being your better self for your higher self, is going to change your life and things are going to come so much more easier. So thank you collectives for watching this. I just want you to know I'm sending you love and light and healing prayers. And I pray for all of you to have the strength and the courage to go within and take that stepping stone and start doing your inner work. So please hit the like and subscribe and that little notification bell. Sorry, my phone's going off. And hit that little notification bell so that you can get more messages because there will be a part two. I just don't have a part two right now. I have to wait for Spirit to be able to channel through me. Um, but the thoughts that they've got throwing at me right now, I'm being told right now that there is a part two and they're wanting me to tell you that this part two consists of whatever um, spiritual person you follow or what, however you classify yours, they are channeling right now to me that there are six other portals and they want me to be able to explain these portals to you. So I will be making another video part two. Other than that, have a beautiful, fantastic Friday. Love you guys all. I am so proud of you. And I'm pushing all that strength and courage behind you to do what you need to do to better yourself. Bye.